Can you see that? What's over you put in there? Hello everyone, I'm back. Opa's busy here dishing for him some liver. I made liver <laughs> and mash. Uh, the video was posted already. Wow, hello, Pima. Oh, Even though for him, I saw the video. Say hello for the means. Hi, hi. Opa, Opa, you got fans. You must say hello to the people. Hello, fans. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello, fans. You got admirers as well. What the? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, enjoy for you. I have no mark. Let me show the people. I'm going to make a pickled um, salmon. I've got two cans of salmon. I've uh, gotten rid of the brine. I got two onions thinly sliced, three red chilies chopped up. I didn't chop it up small. It's on purpose so big, so if you spot it while you're eating it and you don't want a chili, you can just take it out. And I've got some sugar, black pepper, vinegar. Normally I throw in parsley, but this time around I'm going to throw in chopped uh, fresh coriander. I've got some coriander seeds and some peppercorns. And that's it. That's the ingredients. Now the sweet and sour, the sugar and the vinegar, it's up to you, your taste. Oh, and I got a little salt as well. And now I'm going to begin. Okay, guys, so I've taken the fish out of the can. And I've also taken or out the bones. Believe it or not, this is edible and it's good for you. But you can take it out if you don't like it. Ne? See, they're taking the bones out. And do this, clean hands. See that parts there? See? I just go wash my hands. Okay. Shelly is very much interested in this dish. Let me show Shelly. Shelly is eating liver there on that side. <laughs> Are you curious? Yes. She can't wait to taste this. Okay. Now, show closer. Okay. And again. Once again, shukran to Auntie Shamra for this beautiful bowl with the lid. Okay, I got the gratin, put it away. So now I'm going to add like all the ingredients at once. You can flick this, but as I'm going to stir, it's going to flick on its own. So preferably, don't be like me in a hurry and just throw everything in. Try to loosen the, the um, onions a bit. This is quite sweet onions, so if you want to, you can soak your onion. If your, if your onion tastes a bit too wild and potent, you can soak it in a little hot water and then strain it. Okay? It's going to break apart as I stir it, most guys. The chilies. And when you work with chilies, please don't touch your eye. Wash your hands thoroughly. Okay, now I'm going to add, this is about a half a teaspoon of coriander seeds. Okay. In peppercorns, a teaspoon of peppercorns. Salt to your taste some black pepper that's just for showing it I'm gonna add more later because people don't like the sound of the ground baby love you can you love a beat in guys out it's a cost I Okay, I'm going to add 
add some sugar this is a quarter cup of sugar and then about a cup or half a cup of white vinegar you can add more vinegar if you like and if you add more vinegar you're gonna have to add more sugar in it and then my dania oh it smells already familiar <laughs> okay i'm gonna taste and i'm gonna ask shelly as well to taste and if i need to add more sugar okay guys so i threw an extra vinegar so i'm just gonna add a bit more sugar okay now we're gonna stir did i forget anything Like making sly, but you just add tin sem. Flick it. Now this you want it to sit for a few hours or overnight. And for those who remember, this is what we always made when we go to the beach. <laughs> and this gets put in a tapway bucky. And you put it on bread or rolls. Wow. Look at that. Now we are going to put it on the rolls. There we go. Our pickled salmon. And the liquor is this. Okay. So this is going to sit for a few hours. And um, when we come back later on, I'm going to put it on some rolls and then you can see. Okay guys, so we're going to um, cut up the baguette, the French loaf. I am going to cut uh, into slices. I'm going to put on some butter and then I'm going to put, up, put in... <laughs> I was dying on the wood. Then I'm going to dish from the pickled, um, pickled salmon on the rolls, okay? Okay, guys. And now it's just about putting some on the roll. You see, like a deer trick. Sunny, you want from that onion and a little bit of the sauce to just drip down into the bread. Okay, I'll just show you this one and then you'll know it's done. And I'm just going to continue. Me, there we go. Look at that yummy in my tummy. There it is, guys. Pickled salmon on bread and butter. Perfect, perfect to make for your day outing or your picnic or on vacation. Easy peasy. Okay, guys. Hope you enjoyed that video and I'll be back again with another video soon. Bye, everyone. <laughs>